All right, hey everybody, so welcome to another After We Collided movie video. Now today's video is talking about something that I've been seeing like online, like pretty much everywhere, uh, in some parts of the fandom where people are starting to wonder, well, because we do not have a promo, because we don't have a teaser, because we don't have a poster, because we don't have anything at this point, a lot of people are starting to wonder, is this film still coming out in 2020? And quite simply, uh, quite simply, quite directly, the answer is, Yes, 100%. Yes, this film will still be coming out in 2020. Because let me go ahead and say this. There are plenty of films that are set to come out in 2020 that have not had a single poster, that have not had a single trailer, that have not had a single anything. And guess what? Some of them have not even started filming yet and yet they are still coming out in 2020. So yes, 100% after we collided will be coming out in 2020. Another big thing that I've been seeing people talk about is, well, wait a minute. Um, if the U.S. does not have a, a distributor yet, will that affect overseas? And the answer is no. Um, unless it is, all right, the only way that the U.S. will affect overseas is if everybody is being distributed by the same person, by the same company. Then yes, of course, over. Then yes, of course, the, the U.S. will affect overseas. Another big way is that, like, let's just say that it's a film like Avengers Endgame, where they want to release it everywhere, you know, day and date, uh, in pretty much every single country to avoid spoilers, because it's like this huge, you know, three-hour spoiler that they don't want anything getting out there. Then yes, of course, that uh, the U.S. could affect overseas. But the fact of the matter is, is that if overseas has a distributor, if there are countries overseas that actually have a distributor and they're ready to go, they have their trailers, they have everything ready to go, then yes, of course, overseas can get it first. And then the U.S. will get it, like, say, a couple months later. Um, I've seen films that, you know, have gone overseas first and then the U.S. have gotten it a couple months later. I've seen films, you know, come to the U.S. first and then, you know, uh, go to overseas. I mean, I've seen that happen both ways. So, yes, of course, if overseas is ready to go, if overseas has a distributor uh, in the different countries, then, yes, of course, overseas can get it first and it will not be affected by the U.S., uh, but like I've always said, or like I've started to say um, on Twitter, on Facebook, on everywhere, I firmly believe, especially with what Anna Todd has been saying the past couple of days, they have a distributor. They have somebody ready to go. Uh, they probably just got to sign, you know, a few more on the dotted lines. And yes, of course, uh, they still, they have a U.S. distributor. They're ready to go. And to the surprise of a lot of you and probably to the anger of a lot of you, I could actually see a world where they have not dropped a single trailer yet, where they have not dropped a poster or anything, and this film could still feasibly come out in February of 2020, because guess what? There is a film coming out in February of 2020 with uh, Will Ferrell that literally just dropped their first teaser yesterday. So yes, I can 100% see a world where After We Collided appears in the U.S. on February uh, in February of 2020. So yes, I can 100% see that happening uh, because let's face it, I know that a lot of people are not going to like this. I know a lot of people do not want to hear this, but After We Collided is still a very small movie. It's still kind of an independent movie. Even if we get like this huge company distributing it, it is still a much smaller movie that they're not going to break the bank to actually, you know, market the film. They're not going to break the bank, you know, to do like this big whirlwind, you know, marketing that I think a lot of people want. Uh, but yeah, that, that's what a lot of people need to remember. So they could feasibly drop the teaser on Christmas. And at the end of the teaser, it says coming February uh, or Valentine's weekend, uh, 2020. And I can honestly see that happening. That would not surprise me. Um, so yeah, I know that a lot of us here in the U.S., we've complained about the marketing, but if we have a much bigger uh, studio this time, if we have a much better distributor this time, I could honestly see them doing like this big marketing push as much as they can, because like I said, After We Collided is still a much smaller film. Uh, so they're not, they're not going to break the bank doing the marketing for it. Uh, but I could see them doing like this, you know, kind of this marketing push and it would still work. And of course, the film could still come out in February of 2020 or, you know, like it could be released in Germany, say, in February of 2020. And the U.S. will not get it until April. And that's completely fine. I mean, that's 100 percent fine, because guess what? 
if overseas has a distributor, if overseas it has everything ready to go, then of course overseas can get it first and then say the US will get it a couple months later. Um, so yeah, jump down to the comment section below. Let me know what you think about all this. As always, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your continued love and support. As always, remember, if you like what you see here and you wanna see more, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's go through all the stuff you'll be able to find on this channel right now. So every day I'll be doing daily uploads of the After Series uh, uh, I'll be doing daily uploads of the read-throughs where I literally go through different books and read to you guys page by page, chapter by chapter, all seven books of the After series. So that means after, after we collided, after we fell, after we're happy, before, nothing more and nothing less are now on the channel to their completion. I'm working on It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover and these will be daily uploads barring any types of personal illnesses or issues. Now that we have the official green light of the After We Collided movie, I'll be bringing you guys constant, constant, constant updates on that. So keep looking forward to that. You guys are going to be so updated that you'll be begging me to stop the updates. And those updates will also cover After We Fell and After Ever Happy. So once we get the green light on those two films, I'll also be bringing you guys constant updates on those as well. Every other day, I'll be doing different topics that come up in the After Fandom. So if there's a topic out there that you guys want to see me talk about, go ahead and either leave it down in the comments, or you can find me on either Twitter, email, or my Facebook. All the relevant information is on the About section of the channel. As always, remember, this channel would not be able to go to the heights that it has without you guys, and so for that, I'm eternally grateful. You know and I know that there are plenty of After fans, old and new, who have no idea that this channel exists. So keep sharing the channel. Keep spreading the word of Charles's movie channel, because this will easily be one of the best after series channels that you'll find right here on youtube or dare i say anywhere so go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already keep liking keep commenting keep subscribing keep sharing my name is charles welcome to the after series channel i'll see you later after fans after naters take care y'all love you